There is the so-called historical anti-Semitism going back hundreds of years, but there is particularly that new form of anti-Semitism born in our neighborhoods, out of the internet, out of hatred, hatred of the state of Israel, and which advocates hatred against the Jews, all Jews. So we need to use the right words to fight this type of totally unacceptable anti-Semitism. And as I have said over and over again, and as the minister Ségolène Royal said this morning in Jerusalem, as Claude Lanzmann wrote in a magnificent paper in Le Monde, yes, we must say to the world, without the Jews of France, France would no longer be France. And that message is one that we all have to deliver strongly and loudly. We did not say it in the past. We did not show our indignation in the past. How can we accept that in some schools, in some colleges, the Shoah cannot be taught? How can it be possible that a seven-year-old child should tell his teacher when the teacher asks him, what is his enemy? that the child should answer, it is the Jews. When you attack the Jews of France, you're attacking France and you're attacking universal conscience. Let us never forget this. And what a horrible coincidence that we see a multiple offender of hatred who is taking center stage and performing at the very time these atrocities are being committed, part of the Vincennes. No, justice must be intransigent, faced with those preachers of hatred. I'm saying this strongly and with determination from this lectern in the National Assembly.